Jessica and I'm back again with another video and for today's video I'm going to be doing a very highly requested video. I'm going to be showing you guys my ab and butt workout routine. I'm basically just going to show you everything that I do when I'm in the gym just to work out my abs as well as my legs and my butt and hopefully this will help you guys in the gym like give you some ideas of workouts that you can do but um, I'm not going to waste any time. I'll just get started right into the video. So first we're going to start off with doing crunches and with all of my ab workouts I always use weights. So here I'm just using this 8 kilogram weights and we're going to be doing about 50 crunches. Next we're going to be doing cherry pickers so we're going to move the weight from side to side and you can do about 30 of these on each side. So next I'm going to be putting on these two and a half pound ankle weights onto each of my ankles and like I said I always use weights whenever I do my ab workouts because it makes the ab workout much more effective. So here we're just going to be doing bicycles going forwards and then we're going to reverse it and then do bicycles going backwards so you can do about 50 of these. Next we're going to be straightening each leg out one by one and going very slowly and controlled is very important with this exercise. And next we're going to be doing leg lifts with our ankle weights so you're just going to be lifting up one leg at a time and you can do about 50 of these on each leg. And now next we're going to turn over to the side and we're going to be doing leg raises again on each side and you can do 50 of these again on each leg. And now this next workout is a killer. So these are scissors and we're going to be doing these with ankle weights and oh my gosh these are very painful but just go at your own pace. So for our next workout we're going to be working out our legs. So I'm taking this 8 kilogram weight and I'm doing lunges across the floor. So you can go forwards and backwards and after this we're going to be taking two weights and we're going to be doing the same thing. For this next workout you're going to need a high surface that's very sturdy and you're just going to be stepping up one leg at a time holding on to the weights on each side. For this next workout we're going to be hopping up onto the surface as fast as you can so like I said make sure that the surface is very sturdy so that it doesn't move when you're doing these. For this next workout, we're going to be doing a plank and then pushing up into a push up position and then going back down onto our plank. And it's very important to keep your core tight and to stay very hollow during this workout. And for our last workout, we're going to be doing squats with a 28 kilogram weight. And you want to make sure that you're keeping your back straight with these and that your knees are far enough apart. <laughs> 